Tropical Cyclone Statement Issued at Saturday, 5.29 a.m. August 3rd Issued by National Weather Service For is located near west-central Cuba this morning and is forecast to move northwest as it emerges into the Gulf of Mexico later today. The system is expected to strengthen to a tropical storm off of the southwest Florida coast by tonight as it begins to move north-northwest. It will continue north on Sunday, with Han eventual north-northeastward motion Sunday night as it approaches the big bend of Florida early Monday morning. Tropical moisture is expected to increase across east-central Florida ahead of this system. Initial rain bands are forecast to move northward from South Florida this afternoon and tonight. Multiple rounds of rainfall are expected to occur over east-central Florida, especially as the system makes its closest approach on Sunday. Locally higher rainfall totals will result from rain bands repeatedly moving over the same locations. Generally, 2 to 4 inches of total rainfall are forecast area-wide with locally higher amounts of up to 6 inches possible. These rainfall amounts, along with instances of higher rainfall rates, will be capable of producing flooding in low-lying and urban areas. Ponding of water on roadways may also lead to hazardous driving conditions. Any future adjustments in the track of this system may result in changes to the current rainfall forecast, AT this time, the system is forecast to be a tropical storm as it approaches the Florida Big Bend Sunday night into early Monday morning. Gusty squalls are expected with this system, and the potential for wind gusts up to 45 miles per hour exists, especially in closer proximity to the center of the storm. A tropical storm watch remains in effect for Lake County for the potential of tropical storm force winds in the next 48 hours. I, in addition to strong wind gusts, a few tornadoes embedded in rain bands are possible into Sunday as the system moves northward. Do not let your guard down, especially in locations east of the current tropical storm watch. Impacts from this tropical cyclone will be experienced far from the center of the storm. Now is the time to ensure your hurricane supply kit is stocked and your safety plan is in place. A.S. Tropical Depression 4 becomes better organized over the next 24 to 36 hours. Additional changes to the forecast are possible. Eastward shifts in the forecast track would increase the potential for additional impacts locally. So continue to monitor the latest forecasts from the National Hurricane Center and National Weather Service in Melbourne, Florida. Dot potential impacts. Asterisk wind. Prepare for hazardous wind having possible limited impacts across Lake County. Potential impacts in this area includes damage to porches, awnings, carports, sheds, and unanchored mobile homes. Unsecured lightweight objects blown about, many large tree limbs broken off. A few trees snapped or uprooted, but with greater numbers in places where trees are shallow rooted. Some fences and roadway signs blown over. A few roads impassable from debris, particularly within urbane or heavily wooded places. Hazardous driving conditions on bridges and other elevated roadways. Scattered power and communications outages. Elsewhere across east central Florida, little to no impact ice anticipated. Asterisk flooding rain. Prepare for dangerous rainfall flooding having possible significant impacts across northern and central portions of east central Florida. Potential impacts include moderate rainfall flooding may prompt several evacuations and rescues. Rivers and tributaries may quickly become swollen with swifter currents and overspill their banks in a few places, especially in usually vulnerable spots. Small streams, creeks, canals, and ditches overflow. Flood waters can enter some structures or weaken foundations. Several places may experience expanded areas of rapid inundation at underpasses, low-lying spots, and poor drainage areas. Some streets and parking lots take on moving water as storm drains and retention ponds overflow. Driving conditions become hazardous. Some road and bridge closures. Prepare for locally hazardous rainfall flooding having possible limited impacts across remaining areas of east-central Florida. Asterisk tornadoes. 
Prepare for a tornado event having possible limited impacts across the north-central portion, east-central Florida. Potential impacts include the occurrence of isolated tornadoes can hinder the execution of emergency plans during tropical events. A few places may experience tornado damage, along with power and communications disruptions. Locations could realize roofs peeled off buildings, chimneys toppled, mobile homes pushed off foundations or overturned, large treetops and branches snapped off, shallow-rooted trees knocked over, moving vehicles blown off roads, and small boats pulled from moorings, precautionary slash preparedness actions. Evacuations. Follow the advice of local officials. Asterisk other preparedness information. Now is the time to check your emergency plan and emergency supplies kit and take necessary actions to protect your family and secure your home or business. When making safety and preparedness decisions, do not focus on the exact forecast track since hazards such as flooding rain, damaging wind gusts, storm surge, and tornadoes extend well away from the center of the storm. Closely monitor weather. Gov. NOAA Weather Radio and local news outlets for official storm information. Listen for possible Changesto the forecast, asterisk additional sources of information for information on appropriate preparations see Reddit, gov, for information on creating an emergency plan see getagameplan.org. For additional disaster preparedness information see Red Cross, Org next update the next local statement will be issued by the National Weather Service in Melbourne, Florida around 12 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, or sooner if conditions warrant.